Hi y'all. I'm here and I'm gonna be harvesting my fingerling potatoes and I have them right here and I'll show you the container that they're in. They're in a container that I had some sage and uh, had some flowers and I, th and I think I have some oregano in here and I'm just gonna dump it out and then hopefully I get some potatoes I'm gonna show y'all okay okay let me take this phone down so you can get, get a look at the container real good okay okay so here's the container it's like a whiskey barrel uh, planter and as you can see these are flowers here uh, let's see there's a little rosemary right there I'll, I'll harvest these out of here too and then there's a little sage right there and it was some oregano, but maybe that um, is gone. Oh no, here it is. This is the, that's the sage. Oh yeah, I got a big old piece of sage there, good. Okay. And um, I can see a potato sticking up already, y'all, look. Can you see that right there? That's a little potato. Okay. All right, and then I had these flowers. And I kind of left them in here because they were pretty. So I left them in there and I got these flowers in there, okay? And the container looks like this. It's a whiskey barrel. Okay, so let me get it flipped over. Then I'll go ahead. Look at that pretty flower. I'll go ahead and flip it. Okay, I got it turned over. And what I'm going to do is lower this camera down there so that you can see it. And uh, you can watch me as I get these fingerlings out. Hopefully I have some. Okay, y'all. All right. Okay, I'm putting these gloves on. And I have it right here. This is the bottom. And then next to me I have the container. Because I'll probably throw some of the dirt in there. Okay. Let's get these, kind of pull them up a little bit. All right. That's better. Okay, so I think you can see this. I sure hope so. All right. see some roots that come all the way down here so I don't know what those roots are but we're gonna find out in a minute it's been raining but this is still dry because it rains and then it goes so many days that it don't rain so everything is dry I'm in upstate New York zone 6a and B and it's about 70 uh, last time I looked, it was like 71, so I think it's about 73 or 74 right now, and sunny. So we had a blessed, uh, we're going to have a blessed weekend here, and next week going to be in the warm too. It's going to be warm for us for October, okay? So let's see what we have here. I'm not seeing much, I'm a lot of roots. I hope them flowers didn't, uh, cause those flowers were pretty big. I hope they didn't mess me up on my potatoes. Okay. I see two, two little ones. Put them over there. I probably should have planted these potatoes by themselves and not with uh, anything else in there with it. That wind just kicked up. Ooh. It's blowing this dry dirt around. But I got to get my dirt off of here. So I can throw this in the other pile. Okay. Throw that over there. Let's see what else. Anything else? 
what I did see was kind of toward the surface. Okay. Here. Okay, now this is the sage. So I'm going to get the, um, the dirt off of here also. Oh, there go a potato. Now these are fingerling potatoes. For anybody watching that don't know what that is, that means they're little bitty potatoes. they fingerlings. That's why they call that. Okay, so they're not big potatoes. They're just little, little bitty potatoes. And I knew that's what, um, I, I planted these from seed inside in the winter. So I'm, I'm pleased with the fact that I've got anything because guess what? I never did plant these kind of potatoes before. Didn't know anything about it. So trying to get the dirt off of this sage. So I'm going to be throwing my dirt away, y'all. Okay. I'm going to put the sage right there because I'm going to keep that. And I'm going to have some potatoes down here. Okay, can you see these? Okay, I got some. I'll put them in there. It's a piece of sage I'll put over there. A couple of pieces of sage I see down here. I'm just going to make sure that I don't have any um, potatoes in that. Okay. All right. So where they at is mostly at the top, so that means I got to be looking down. I don't see anything. Um, that was just the label for the. Oop, that was the label for the um, some of the herbs I had in there. Okay, see these. All right, I'll put those over there. Got another one. There. Put that in there. Oop. I got some more here. They read all at the top here. Oop. Falling down. <laughs> they got it hard to keep up with. There they go. So if you're looking for some big big potato harvest, that, that's not what this is. This here is more like an experiment for me the first time ever planting these and planted them from seed to see how this goes, to taste them, to see what they taste like. Is it worth it for me to do it next year? Um, maybe do more? Um, that's what this is. So... This is a uh, soil that I mixed up myself. Here, here goes some. It's kind of nice size one in there. And then here goes some more. I got a nice one right here. See that one? Okay, I'm just trying to make sure I got y'all in the camera because the sun is really bright out here and I cannot see what you can see, okay? So I'm going to put them over there and uh, keep going. See if I see any more. That's my my label. I'll keep that because I write on both sides of my label. Then I throw them away. So that one here. Let's see here. I probably didn't even really need to dump this one out the way it's working out there all at the top. I didn't know anything about it, so... I'm learning. Feel something there. Let's see if I can lay them right there. The piece. I can get through here. And a couple here. And oh, look at this. Mm. Y'all see these hanging? See them? All them on there? Let's get them off. Oh. <laughs> they flowing all over. They going all over the place, y'all. Look at these. 
Hey, <laughs> I'm happy about it. I'm seeing something. I don't need a lot. Put that over there. There's one that fell down there. Put that in there. This is the kind of thing that's good when um, I would say, ooh, these are bigger. Wow, look at them. Look at this one. Can y'all see how big it is? And then there's another one that's a nice size also. So I got these two. Great. Get this label out of there. And see if I see any more over here in that section. Okay, I see there's some right here. There's some right here. All right. I got two, three. They sort of all different sizes. But I did get some nice size ones. Oh, uh, this one that fell over here. Let me get that. Alright. I'm going to try to set this up here. I'm going to try to set it up. Mm. Mm. Alright. It's interesting. Now, these here, that's them. One of them got a little green on there, but I would cut that off and still use it. But what I was talking about was interesting was the color of it. Most of these are red, but but those are a different color. See that? Look at look at here. That's a real nice one right there. And then I have these here. Uh, those good. Those are good. And then, so that's what we got. Real nice. All right. Let's see here. I see the rosemary. I have to get that out of there. Look at that big one. Wow. <laughs> Look at that, y'all. Can you see how big it is? Nice. And look at this one. Isn't that nice? These are two nice ones. And then there's a couple little ones. So I would say, oh yeah. Oh yeah. The reason I'm doing that is because I'm trying to make sure if y'all can see it because I have to, I had to lower it so low um that i can't see what you can see so the sun is blinding me and also i can't see what you can see okay but i got a couple here see? this one's nice oh. Nice. Now I got this rosemary here, but I've got to be careful pulling it because the dirt come up and go in my eye. It's allergy time for me. You can't see it, but right now my eyes are watering. So makes it a little hard to see in the sun beating down on the camera. Oh, they got one that went down there. I got a couple here. And, oh, yeah. Look at that. Yeah, I would say this is a success. This is a success. Because I did not know if I would get anything. Never planted them before. And I'm, I'm liking what I'm seeing so far. Definitely. It's a nice one right here. You see that? 
Nice. Put that over there. Alright, let's see. Try to get this rosemary out of here because I'm going to keep that. Get the dirt off, oh, get my good dirt off of here, y'all. How's everybody's fall going? I hope everybody's in good health. That's the most important thing. Mental and physical good health. Then everything else springs off of that. Okay, so that was the rosemary that was in there. I know that's not what this is about, but I'm just showing it to you. Because it was in the container with that. Okay. Let's see what else we got here. I see more potatoes. I see more of them. Yes, I do. Oh, look at this one. Right there. Pretty nice. And uh, get that dirt off of that, off of these other ones. They're kind of smaller. Let's see. Let's see these little ones. I can't see what you can see. I'm hoping y'all can see them. Right there. And this one. Put that over there. Let's see what else I can find here. Let's see what else I can find. The little bitty ones. But I'm going to keep them anyway. I wonder if you can take these little ones and keep them like you do with the regular potatoes and plant them next year. Like I did with my white potatoes. If you know, comment below. Or oh, uh, do these all have to always be done from seed? Because I planted these from seed, but I didn't know anything about them. See that? That potato, and that's a nice one. And then here's another nice size one. And then I have these over here. They're kind of falling out of my hand. So that's what I got all together. I'll show them all to you at the end. The haul. The potato haul. Okay. Let's see what else we have here. Uh, in this dirt I put peat moss, cow manure, perlite, vermic vermiculite. I saw one go down here, but I don't see it now. Um, and bone meal. So that's what I put in this dirt. And uh, I use my weed fertilizer. And I'll, I'll link the uh, video of the weed fertilizer that I make, that I fertilize with. And I did a video where I actually showed fertilizing that. It, I think it's in there, fertilizing this with it. Yeah, I think it's in there. In that video that I'm gonna link. Let me get these up. Here we go. There we go. That one's nice. And then they've got this one. That's not that's a nice one too. And then a couple little ones in here. Put that over there. So you just kind of pick up the roots and the and they uh attached on here. I would hold it up more for you, but, but this wind is and picked up out here a little bit and I don't want that blowing in my eye, this dirt. Okay. 
Okay, we got these. This one. Here. Here. And here. That's what I have. Nice, nice, nice. Okay. Oop. These are falling off. I got it. Oh, wow. I'm, I'm, I'm really... <laughs> I'm very happy. Look at this. Yeah. I thought, oh, I'm not going to get anything out of there. If I do, it'll be one little meal. This is going to be more than one little meal. Nice. Got these. And then that one right there where my thumb is. Yeah. Okay. I will have to plant them again. I will have to plant these again. Well, this is a success. Throw that away. And that's just some more debris. Okay, now I gotta kinda, I saw some potatoes around here. I don't know why I keep saying oops. I wish I would stop doing that. But they kind of surprise me when they pop out. I got these. Nice ones. Not bad. And. Oh, here's a nice one. And that's pretty good. Put that over there. Let's see what else we got here. I've been waiting on the weather to be where I could come out here and do this. And today is perfect. I still have another harvest to do. And hopefully the weather will cooperate with me. And I'll be able to, to do that harvest and show it on a video here in upstate New York, zone 6A and B. Ooh, went down there, see it? Two of them, that one, and then this one, nice. Wow, <laughs> look at that, look at that. Yeah, that's a big one. Okay. Let's see what we have here. Any more? If there's any more in here. Let's see here. Let's throw this out. Trying to get my dirt off of here, y'all. Get my dirt off. I might have some more. We in this corner. Uh, let me see if there's anything over there. So that's that root. And let's see if there's anything that grew around it. Right here. I'm trying to I'm trying to lift it up. There's 
anything in that? Nope. Nothing. Okay. I hear a bird out here. I looked out here and still saw a robin. I thought the robins would leave. Uh, they're still around. At least one I saw. I'm not sure what kind of bird that is that's making that sound. I'm just breaking this ball up, y'all. I'm breaking the ball up to see if there's anything in the ball. see anything else or maybe that's it okay let me lay them all out on here so you can see what I got from it this is one container this is all I planted this season because it was a test and uh, I think the test came out pretty good but the taste test will be the the final conclusion of to me is how do they taste okay so let's lay them out Some that fell over here by my boots. Let's put that back up there. I think that was all. Nope, it's not. I thought I saw a potato right here. A little bit of one. Okay. Put that over there. Okay, so I'm going to take these gloves off so that I can pull the phone down and show you uh, close up what I have. Okay, here you go. A closer look at them, y'all. Let me see if I can... The sun is really bright and blinding. But it's a blessing to have it. See? Some nice sized ones in here. Yeah. I got quite a few of the nice sized ones. Smaller ones. They're still good eating. Let's see. Pick this one up here. that fell. Put it back up there. So there they go. If you like the video, go ahead, give me the thumbs up. All right. Thank you. Subscribe. Go check out my other potatoes harvests. Bye. See you next time. Bye-bye.